Maya Morales is out for the Steam Deck right now. So if you've been waiting to play this game on the Steam Deck because you never had a PS5, this is the perfect time for you to play this amazing game. But before you get before you start playing this game, these are some few tips I would recommend you use to help you have a great gaming experience. Let's dive into it. The first step when you buy this game off the Steam store, I would suggest that you would go first into first download it to your ex internal hard drive because if you use a micro sd card that, that work perfectly fine but the game would take a little while longer to upload and since it's new and it's sending out constant updates we don't know how the performance is going to be if you download it onto a micro sd card so if your internal sd have enough storage Download it first onto your internal storage so your game will boot up faster and everything will go smooth without any hesitation. The next step is to get a controller. Yes, get a controller. As you can see, I have a PS5 controller because I had a PS5. The keyword had. Since I get my Steam Deck, it's been my go to for everything. So, anyhow, get a controller, it could be any controller, pair it with your Steam Deck, and then what you would do hit the options button go down into properties and you want to make sure that you go down to general and select this game resolution 1280 by 800 even though the steam deck can go as high as as um 4k but if you try to force the steam deck to play at 4k the game is going to take forever to load so, i don't know why it's doing that but anyway it's going to take forever to load and even when i tried at 2k because i tried it at 2k it's going to be choppy and the main screen is going to take almost forever to load up so do not select 4k or 2k stick with the native resolution of the screen 1280 by 800 it works perfectly fine you won't have no delay no choppiness no hesitation so bear that in mind next what you need to do is to go into the compatibility or you want to click this Force the use of a specific Steam Play compatibility tool. There are several there you could choose from, but the two key players are the Proton Experimental and Hotfix. I've used I use both of them and they're pretty fine. Proton Experimental or Hotfix. So you could use either one. Either one will, will, will work perfectly fine. But right now I'm rocking Hotfix to see what it's like, and so far it's pretty good. So don't forget, go into general. Select this, select the game resolution 1280 for 800 if you're going to play on the Steam Deck screen. And two, don't forget to go into the compatibility and select a compatibility tool. All right, this is the part of the video I want to show you guys. I don't want you to be alarmed. So I'm going to show you something. After this Marvel sign go, it takes a good while to go to the main screen. I don't know why it is. So maybe don't use a bug or that's how the game is made up to be. So it usually takes approximately almost 11 seconds from the Marvel screen to come to the main screen right here. So if you're thinking it's something wrong with your console, it's nothing wrong with the console. And there's no other setting you could do to fix this unless there's somebody finds something and can resolve it. But, but I've tried everything so far and um, it always takes this time at least 11 seconds to get to this main screen so if you start if you're playing the Miles Morales for the first time on the Steam Deck uh, wondering why it takes so long to get to this main screen don't worry hopefully in a few software updates they will iron out the kinks so it will load faster so it is what it is right now all right let's get into it what we're going to do next is I already um, do some things but I wanted to share something with you guys these are some things you need to do when you're setting up my Morales, you first want to go into settings. Remember earlier we talked about the display. You want to go into the display and graphics. And make sure, let me zoom in for you guys so you can see. You want to make sure that you select it to the, to the resolution. 1280 by 800. And you can mess around with the aspect ratio if you want. You can go by 16 to 9. Or you could do automatic. I'll just leave it at automatic because it's, it's pretty fine as it is. And also, what you want to do apply changes and also another thing I want to share with you guys just for the interest of time I did it again 
it's almost 12 seconds so like i said maybe it's a bug error maybe it's a bug i don't know but bear that in mind so there's nothing wrong with the console maybe over the course of a few days steam will send an update to shorten the, the upload time so that's perfectly fine okay let's go back into what we were talking about earlier because i just did that again for the interest of time you're already going to the graphics and display you already select auto 12 1280 by 800 that's good next what you need to do is this going to connections where did i go again going to connections and you want to select this in the beginning of the game in the beginning of the game because i did it already in the beginning of the game it's going to ask it's going to ask you to link up to link to your link to your psn network if you have a psn network do it if you don't just go ahead and sign up and it's going to be worth it the reason why when you sign up to the PS, psn network or if you are or if you're a playstation owner and you already got a account and you log into it these are the benefits you're going to get when you log on when you sign into your ps network account this is what this is what's going to happen you go you get two suits for free which is pretty cool so i just want to go into it and show you guys let me get out of here and like i said for hot fix so far it's look this game has been pretty good so i would have no problem with it on hot fix so i just want to go into here and show you guys so again get go into your go into your psn network register sign up the way you need to do and this is what's going to happen you get two suits in the start of the game you get this one right here the my morales 2099 suit and you get this one right here the advanced tech suit so don't forget when you start when you, when you start the game you do all the displays and everything go into connections or it's going to act right in the beginning of the screen connect to a psn network or if you don't have one register for one because when you do it you get these two free suits again you're going to get not this one because you get a straight with the game you get this one right here the my morales 2099 suit and the advanced tech suit as a start off so which i think that's pretty cool so anyhow i hope this video was pretty um helpful for you guys and um i can't wait to see you guys in the next video this is a boy JC. I appreciate you guys for tuning in. So don't forget to just go for, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. I really appreciate it. And I hopefully I'll see you in the next few videos when it comes to Spider Morales and more things pertaining to Steam Deck. Have a good day, everybody.